And this is the uh, city of Adelaide with its square mile, surrounded by Greater Adelaide. And this blue line around the square mile of Adelaide is called the Inner Ring Route. And this other one is the Outer Ring Route. This is the southern suburbs. And we can see that southern suburbs is low height buildings with high density of one household per allotment development. One of the things that's happening in this area around the Unley District Centre is that the town planners are looking at redeveloping the district centre by changing the allowed heights. If you look at Arthur Street Unley Road as it is now, we go down to street level. Unley Road, Arthur Street, we can see here is a single story building with a corner building which probably was a hotel originally and uh, one story buildings and uh, some two story buildings and this four lane highway, four lane road is a major road for through traffic from the southern suburbs to the city and from the city to the southern suburbs. If we go back to the plans, we can see it's proposed that this side of Arthur Street, the north side of Arthur Street, is going to be potentially up to nine storeys in height. And this section just here will be seven storeys in height. And this area here would be five stories in height. Now if we look at the town plan for traffic we'll see that the town planners think that Unley Road during peak period is a major a problem for movement and so what they're going to do is minimize vehicle access onto the road and so it's going to become a through road and local people will not be able to move from one side of Unley Road to the other without any ease. Now if we look at uh, Adelaide, just go to Port Adelaide This is Port Adelaide, and if we go down to street level Port Adelaide, at a place called the Black Diamond Corner, what looks like street level is actually not the way it always was. This building, the Port Admiral Hotel, this level actually is the second story of the hotel. The first story is actually beneath the current road level and because of local problems with flooding with high tides they actually raised the whole street level to a higher to this new position so that the Port Emerald Hotel is actually a three-storey building but only two of them are obvious and if you want to go into the hotel they have tours where you can go and see this lower level. Now other cities have got similar problems. So if we go to Chicago in the United States it's a very flat area like Adelaide and in earlier times they actually changed the levels of the streets 
because they, in the 1850s, they wanted to bring in sewerage, and so they raised the level to the first storey so they could run the sewage pipes on the original road level. If we look at the central part of, of Chicago, at, uh, Wack at Wacker Drive, this is the Chicago River. This is Wacker Drive and we can see there's a, a t what looks like a tunnel. In fact, Wacker Drive is three levels. So this is Wacker Drive. The red line indicates the current level, which you can see in the streetscape. And beneath that, there are two other levels. And what they do in Chicago in Wacker Drive in fact, you can see here in Chicago there are multiple um, three-level streets and another three-level street here and some three-level street there and three-level street. So what we've got in Chicago in Wacker Drive example, if we take a street view and drop it at this point here, we should drop down to the lower level. And so we're now at the lower level. So what they're doing is local traffic exists on the top level and through traffic is on the lower level. So Wacker Drive is a three level street. Now if we go back to to Unley One solution to the fact that the street has got so many buildings facing the road would be to turn it into a multi-level road where the local traffic would be on the top deck and the through traffic would be on the lower deck and the lower deck could include a busway to take buses from this section underneath Green Hill Road through the parklands and then into the square mile of the city and later on perhaps buses could join from the hills onto this southern busway. So it's proposed that the redevelopment of the city of Unley should also include traffic considerations with the building of multi-level roadways similar to what we can see in Chicago and as we saw happened in the Port Adelaide in the 1850s.